Hello everybody, autumn season has started. This is GeoGuessr's fourth competitive season. We had the better season, the spring season, the summer season, and now autumn or fall, I guess, if you're American speaking. And I suspect we'll have winter season. Mm, I'm good at predicting things, we'll see. Anyway, it seems we have seven weeks this time uh, before the end of the autumn season. I have not started playing any game yet. Yet, yet, I don't know why I say yet, yeti, I, I guess, I don't know, uh, it doesn't matter, I'll keep this. And as always, I'm gonna play one mode of each game for the series, and that is Battle Royale Distance, Countries, and Duel. If you have not checked out my other videos, feel free to do so, you'll see how I performed in the other seasons, where I finished up 120th for the summer season, which is my best ranking so far. So let's see if I can end up in the top 100 out of, I guess, about 60,000 players uh, in the season, because there were 60,000 players in the summer season. So without further ado, I'll get started playing Battle Royale Distance. So let's click. Just a quick reminder, up to 10 players, you have to guess as close as possible on Google Maps as to where the photo shown is actually located and to get qualified to the next round you should not be the last person i.e. the farthest away from the actual spot. There's one minute per round and three up to three possible guesses on a world map. All right as always I'll try to explain my choices. We seem to have European architecture. This looks like an old maybe a ladder I don't know could this be Romania? I don't think so. I don't recognize the utility poles. And maybe it's more Southern, Euro Southern European. Would this be Serbia? I can move around. And I should not forget, I have three guesses also. Uh, we have these orange roofing. It reminds me a bit of Serbia, I think. Let's see if I can go around here. 30 seconds left. No, we have... That's weird. We have this orange plastic here, plastic car. I don't know. This could be also Slovenia. No, it's written in Cyrillic here. I have 18 seconds. So maybe Bulgaria, actually. Let's go for Bulgaria. Okay, this is not the best guess. Uh, people, as you can see on the right-hand side, I, there's one person who's further away. Oh, very, very close to me now. Two seconds. Just qualified. It was it was Serbia, and I went for Bulgaria. I don't know why. As always, you probably saw this in my other videos. I say something, and I do the opposite. I guess classic contradiction in me, but I'll say it's in human beings just to give me a bit of uh, sympathy for myself. This looks like Vienna with this lamp um, attached that way. We have the EU license plate, or at least we're in Europe. Hotel Stephanie. I'm just checking if this is not Prague, but I don't think so. No, we have the typical um, Vienna uh, street sign here. It's two dots. I suspect it's very close to the city center. The problem is a lot of people will probably know this is Vienna. This is one of the easiest locations to find. Okay, on the second best guess, but it's going down to third best guess, 50 meters away. Uh, where am I going to find the second district? Comedian? No, is it? Yeah, Comedian Gasa. Gasa means street. Let me guess again. I'm a bit closer. Five seconds left. I'll make it to the next round. It was 808 meters. As you can see, my internet connection is a bit slow because I'm actually playing from Nairobi in Kenya. So hopefully being in a... In another country than my usual home country will give me an edge. I don't know why I say this. There's no reason. Okay, this looks like the UAE. We have these big cars and it's like looks like the desert. We don't have yellow license plate. We have the UAE flag right here. So here we go. But where in the UAE is going to be the question? I'm going to go um, close to Dubai and a little bit further here. Um, actually, you don't need to go f much further away from the coastline to see all these or that, or that sand. So it's not like in the middle of the desert, like here, let's say, close to Al Ain. You can actually be very close to Dubai and you'll have this sand. All right, it's the third best guess. I used to be the first one. Four kilometers. Where should I go further? Someone has clearly not guessed the UAE. Let me do another guess. Four kilometers, maybe this way. 
let's see yep it's a bit better you can see i moved to the second spot i only need not to be the last one i.e with this red bar 19 kilometers as you can see it was very close to the coastline wow even you could even say it looks like it's in the city um so i guess there's a lot of sand everywhere in the streets of dubai where i've been many many times but not obviously in every single street okay this gives me a south american vibe uh, actually, this is, I think it's Portuguese, no? Sua Saude E. That's, it's probably Brazil, isn't it? Um, Casa Doblo. Do we have more indication here? Yeah, this I think is Portuguese. Now, we're in, Por in, in Portugal. It's not Portugal, this is Brazil. In fact, we probably had a confirmation with the orientation of the sun. No, it's pointing south, it seems. So we'd be in the northern hemisphere, but Brazil has both. So... Let me go back one step, 24 seconds. Remember, I have, oh, you have the Brazilian flag, Maranha, I think, yeah, Brazilian, and another flag, actually. So would this be, oh, Maranho, Maranho, I think I saw this written here, right? State police, militar do Maran, and I can see the, can see the end, and I'm the best guest so far. Come on, we're going to make it to the podium. I said the podium, it's only because it's the first three spots, and that allows me to get some seasonal Season points. Yes, it was the state of Maranhao. Sorry if I don't pronounce correctly. So I was lucky to see this. That's why I came back. You saw I actually moved forward and I saw something on the written on the wall and actually came back. All right, this is very likely Scandinavia. You see these birch trees, boulot, uh, as we say in French, since I'm French. Okay, what do we have here? Hang on, we had a street sign. Where, where is it? Oh no, it's just a bus. Uh, it's very flat, so I'm thinking this is going to be Finland or maybe Estonia. I'm, could be Sweden as well. I know I'm saying a lot of countries, but it's roughly in that area. I don't know where you have the yellow signs for the... Oh, let's see the crossing. Yes, five. One, two, three, four, five. Zebra crossing. This is Finland. Let's go close to Helsinki. Come on. That did my guess. Thank you very much. Uh, internet lag. I guess I have to take this into account. Okay, so you see this five zebra crossing. It's usually only in Finland. Oh, shoot, I'm eliminated. If I can't do a Beckett, better guess, 6.6 .6 kilometers. Uh, let me get more north. And I am qualified because I made a better guess. It was Tampere, so I went more north because I had made two guesses closer to Helsinki. It's the final. The f I'm not going to sing the final countdown, but I have this in my, in my head now when I say the final. Okay, so I can get the maximum number of points. Let's see. Okay, seems like we have a Mercedes here with a blue strip on the left. Sun is towards the south, so we're in the northern hemisphere. This looks like an Italian or Greek. It's... No, yes, it is Greek, isn't it? No, Greek? I, almost, I don't know why I'm saying this. This is Russian, a Cyrillic. Um, I don't know what I'm saying. I'm saying nonsense because I'm stressed. So, Dobrych, Balchik, Pogiri, Gorovo. Would this be Bulgaria? I guess it could be. Yeah, let's see. I'm going to do... It's very flat. I'm going to go to this area, although I don't see the mountains anywhere. Uh, and usually in that area, you see the mountains in the north. 256 kilometers. Let's see, closer to Varna, maybe? Oh, I'm closer. 52 kilometers. Uh, no, it, it's not. Further south, maybe? Four seconds. I'm not going to get it. Knocked out. It was Dobrich. Oh, it was in that area next to Varna. Oh. oh, it was so close. I was 52 kilometers from the correct location. And I lost. So, uh, where did I lose? Um, nothing in terms of my ELO rating. I'm still at 1,055. My highest one, 1,085. Let's see, main menu. Why am I, why am I getting only seven placement points? I think they, they, they changed. Oh, no, no, seven, okay. For 28 season points. Here we go. So I can get 40, the maximum, if I win 28, if I'm second. All right, not too bad. Not too bad for a start. Let's do Battle Royale countries. In this case, I have no choice but to guess the exact country. And actually, I see I have a plus one on the left here. I'm actually gone up one in the rating, 1056. I think there was a little bug on the display screen. Battle Royale countries. Here we go. Up to 10 players. One minute and 30 seconds to guess. But I have to be at least not the last person to guess. 15050, which is my lifeline that I can use only one time across the entire game. 
and three possible guesses. On the first round, there's one exception. Uh, everyone can get qualified if you find the right country within the time limit. There is no elimination if you're the last one to guess on the first round. So have to relax, breathe. Just did it. Okay, squarish license plate. Is this the US by any chance? Police warning. This looks like the US, isn't it? Doesn't it? No, it's not the US. People have guessed incorrect already the US. I guess it's Canada, right? Should we go for Canada? Any reason it should not be Canada? I think it has no reason to not be Canada. Here we go. And it was Calgary, Edmonton. Edmonton. Okay, Calgary is more north, isn't it? No, more south. Sorry. Sorry, sorry. Um, okay, so qualified. I was there in the eighth spot. One person is already eliminated. They used their three guesses. We have nine people qualified now. Only eight people can make it. All right, this looks like Austria with this uh, red, white, red. Yes, I'm going to go for Austria very quickly. I recognize the lamps um, in the streets up there. I almost don't need to move too much. It's written in German. Here we go. This is Vienna. So I've seen this repeatedly in Austria where you have this red, white, red strip on these road poles. Um, so that's just, okay, what do we have here? Slow. So is this the UK or Ireland? It's very green. Don't know what to do. Let's go for the let's go for the UK. I'm worried about it being eliminated. Correct. Correct. Whew. Everyone made it actually, I think. Seven people are playing. Six can make it to the next round. Very dry again. Southern Ooh. Oh, there's holes in the poles. The middle oh, I don't remember. Is this Portugal? Portugal or Spain? I don't remember. Montuato, it sounds maybe Portuguese. Yes, 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 it's Portuguese. These little holes in the utility poles, I think they're typical of Portugal. And I, and I saw, I think, uh, Vineyard also, which is typical of Greece and Spain and Italy and Portugal mostly. Uh, what do we have here? Again, Europe, Eastern Europe, maybe Romania, maybe Bulgaria, not too certain. It's very flat. Oh, utility pole here. Going all the way down. This is going to be our friends from... Oh, my guess was wrong. Spectate, where was it? How come Hungary... How come I was eliminated? I, there were still people playing. What happened? Oh, maybe it's an internet lag. Oh my god, I don't know what happened. It was Hungary. All right. So also Hungary has holes in their UTD poles and have lost... How many points? Play again. Oops. I pressed by accident. Uh, play again for countries, but that's the whole point. I'm going to do another one because I don't like being eliminated um, so quickly. Uh, I guess it's my internet connection here, waiting for players to join. Uh, I think I lost up to 15 ELO rating points on that one. Um, but I, I saw other people play. I'm very surprised I got eliminated because when I... I don't know what happened. Maybe I'll watch the recording to understand what, what happened, but not a big deal. Um, let's see. We're waiting for more players to join. I'll refresh the screen. Okay. Here we go. We have at least three players. No. All right. Two players. Okay. Right, here we go. So usually Romania has uh, paint on the bottom side of the utility pole. In this case, like there was no paint. Like this white paint about one meter from the ground up. And this one did not, so I guess I should have thought about Hungary. France and Poland also have these holes in the UTT poles. Not exactly the same. All right, anyway, it happens. This is a speed game as well. Here we go. Okay, we're in the Northern Hemisphere. Very likely. Is this a flag or something? A lot of water around. A bit confused to where we are. A lot of mountains. Would this be Turkey? Somewhere in Turkey. Let's see. What do we have written on this sign? No, this is written in uh, Cyrillic. And it, oh, we have bars on a car and silly Kyrgyzstan. Here we go. 
Kyrgyzstan because we have the mirrors and the bars of the street view car. Wow, and you have all these mountains, snowy mountains in the backdrop. Okay, so I guess everyone's going to make it if they know this. You see these houses, they're all triangle, so funny. One, two, three, four, five. So funny. Uh, it doesn't seem inhabited though. I don't, I don't see even windows or blinds to this thing. Interesting. Okay, so waiting for the other players if they want to get qualified for the next round. So as you have may, may have noticed, I'm a bit stressed because at the same time what is at stake is my overall ELO rating. Just like in chess, you get a number of points. And I'm very close for the first time ever to the next division, uh, which is the champion division, when you have more than uh, 1,100 rating points. And right now, I guess I went down to 1,040. Uh, which is not too bad. I'm actually not very optimistic. I'm probably going to go down below 1,000 since I haven't played for about two weeks. Okay, we have a license plate here. And we can see N, N for Norway. I can see the flag next to it. I'm not going to even look around. I'm going to assume this is Norway and everyone will have seen this. Here we go. It's Oslo. And I guess what you can see, do we see one here? Maybe this van over here. Ut uh, ut uh, utility vehicles have a green license plate. Okay, I couldn't find one. Seven people are still in the game. Come on. Not going to lose stupidly this time again. Um, this looks like the UK or Ireland to me. Maybe more Ireland. Driving on the left. I need to guess quickly to not be eliminated. Let me go for Ireland. Hopefully I am not making a wrong guess here. And if so, it is Ireland. Great. It looked uh, very green and I don't know, something about these yellow dashes on the side, but maybe this is completely incorrect. Oh, there's one more thing I remember I saw, which is this house here, uh, which is not made of bricks, but this white uh, uh, wall made me think of Ireland a bit more than the UK. All right, six people made it so far. Come on. Where are we now? This looks like an old Russian car, but we have these birch trees. I'm actually thinking more Baltic state. But which one? Oh, 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 I need to hurry up. Let's go for Estonia, maybe. It's not Estonia. Let's go for Latvia. It's not. I'm going to go 50-50 since not many. Norway or Sweden? Shoot. Let's go for Sweden. Correct. <sighs> I'm breathing. Luleå, I guess. It looks like close to Luleå. Yeah, it is Luleå. Okay. Spectate. Oh, wow. I would not have expected these uh, old cars here. Okay, I used my 50-50. I panicked. Um, although there are still four spots, but here it is. Okay. Oh, shoot. I don't remember where you have these road bollards. Oh, hang on. We have something here. This is going to be Sweden, isn't it? Again? I think it's Sweden. Correct. In, th in that case, we're in southern Sweden. Four people made it. I guess someone made a mistake. Just recognize the writing on the road sign here. Oh, where is this? Is this Turkey this time? Let me go back up here. Oh, what do we have here? Buses. Yeah, it sounds Turkish. It reads Turkish to me. We'll know in a second. Yep, made it. There's definitely an internet lag because everyone was already qualified. Oh, I'm on the podium this time. Okay, come on, let's focus. This is going to be Europe uh, because of the vegetation. Europe or... Oh, shoot. I don't have my 50-50. Is it Romania? I don't think so. It's not France. I want to guess France. Oh, here we go. We have something here. Turia, is this Turja? Turja? Is this is this Slovenia? I don't think so. Oh, here we go. We have something here. No, this is this is Romania. I think I recognize the. Here we go. It's Romania. I recognize the language. The little the thingy below the S and the T. This is only found in Romanian, as far as I know. Programul Național de Desvoltare locala. I don't know desvoltare what this means, but I don't care. I'm in the final. Finally, that's good revenge from my disaster previous guess. Okay, come on. Oh, yellow line in the middle. Are we, is this the US? Double yellow line in the US. This looks like the US. I mean, like middle of nowhere. Let's go for the US very quickly. I have two seconds left. They have made their guess. I was knocked out. Oh my god, that was a terrible guess. It was Uruguay. It is. <laughs> oh my god, this definitely not, definitely not the US. Okay, I get 28 season points. Came in second. Not too bad. So I did lose 11, 
uh, rating points before, uh, and I guess I get zero for ending up second. All right, one duel, and then I guess we'll wrap up the video, unless I perform terribly. Let's see, who do we have here? 1,000 points as well. Oh, exactly the same strength. Can I say hello to them? Yes, here it is. Um, okay, so this looks like this could be Senegal. Driving on the right, we have the bars. It looks very sandy. We have a... Oh, we have the rift in the sky. But where in Senegal? I have no no clue. I'm going to hedge my bet. I'm just going to go close to... Well, not really hedging. To Dakar and... I don't know if it's Thiers or Thiers. Don't know. Oh, I'm a bit closer. But that's pure luck. And that's just uh, eating 68 points into their scores. This is nothing. And they knew it was Senegal anyway. Looks like the Baltic state. We have this A shape. You know, the support polo down there. No, maybe not. This could be... Oh, well, it could be. It could be. Yeah, we have a birch tree, I think, here. So I'm thinking Baltic, Lithuania, or... We don't have many... I don't know. Not many trees. So I'm thinking Lithuania. Okay, they've guessed. Do we have any other utility pole here that could help? 11 seconds left. Uh, we don't have much, do we? Okay, let me put something close to Latvia, just in case. Here we go. It was Lithuania next to Vilnius. I'm a bit further away, so I'm losing, this time, almost 200 points. Not a big deal. Still in the game. Double yellow line in the middle. Huh. Double yellow line, but that doesn't look like... Driving on the left. Bit confused with this one. Thinking this could be Malaysia. Don't know why I'm saying this. Because of the infrastructure, maybe. Although we don't see much of it. And driving on the left, actually. And I think there's this bit... Okay, Henry, go back a second here. Oh, no, no, it's Thailand. Written in Thai. I was about to say it. Of course, it was in my head. Um, so you can, I can always say this. It's easy for me to say it after the fact. So Thailand... Oh, and these are typical Thai poles, I think. Black separated by two white things, uh, concrete. It doesn't look like Bangkok, but it doesn't look very mountainous either. I don't know where this would be. Um, I do not know. They've guessed. I'm going to hedge, I guess. It could be further south. I do not know. I'm just going to go in close to Bangkok because I just don't know. It is further south. I had a hunch it would be further south because of the vegetation. It makes no difference. I'm just... Eight kilometers further away. Not a big deal. Okay, it's not too bad for not having practice for for quite some time. Okay, we have the snorkel here and the little thing. So we're in Kenya. So this is where I am at the moment. Um, this is a funny coincidence. Any indication? Uh, clearly not Nairobi, but Nairobi is I don't know where, quite wide and spread out. But here we go. Okay, Kenya. Don't know where I'm going to put this. Not far away from Nairobi. It's Mombasa. It's Mombasa. I can guess this one. So I'm still losing a few points. Not a big deal. We're almost at the maximum number of points. Now is the healing round. So as you may know, I can only gain points to go back to 6,000. What does utility pole look like? No idea. Um, where is our sun? Our sun is... We're in the southern hemisphere. Oh, they've already guessed. I don't recognize these utility poles, actually. Nine seconds, seven seconds. I don't know, maybe South America? I don't know. Don't recognize this. Yep, it's Chile. Um, so I get my points back to 6,000. They went for Botswana, I don't know why. Guess too quickly. They, they cry, they put the crying emoticon. So I guess they made an accident here. But it's not a big deal, it's just the healing around. Okay, this looks like, again, we're on the African continent. Uh, because the person walking there... Driving on the left, so we're going to be in Eastern or Southern Africa. Maseru sounds that we could be in Eswatini. I'm thinking Eswatini or Lesotho Town Center, Leribe. I'm thinking it's Lesotho. And now I know how to pronounce it. It's Lesotho in English. Fuel, fueling station. Yeah, okay, fine. But that doesn't help, does it? Maseru Bridge. Can I find any? Oh, is it Lesotho written here? No, Basutu or something. What does it say? Maseru. Maseru is the, here. Is the capital city, isn't it? Maseru Bridge. Let's go to the capital city. They probably found it as well. 
Oh, they're oh, they found it. Wow, they have five thousand points. Well done. And I've lost five points. That's nothing. Okay. Wow. Nice. Nice done. Uh, nicely done. Um, I don't know. Anyway, I'm gonna say congratulations afterwards. Where are we here? Oh, we have bars and again a rift in the sky. So would this be Senegal once again? It's quite green. I'm thinking Senegal. Um, but where? Honestly, every time I go east, it's west and vice versa. So I'm just going to put it here. It was completely east this time. I'm a bit closer. It doesn't change much. As you can see, it's double damage. It's going to get interesting. 2.5 damage. We are in Europe. Why? Because, I don't know, the road, the vegetation. Well, I should say, no, I don't know, because I'm trying to also explain to you why the reason for my choices. Is this Belgium? Because of this brick place, a uh, brick house here? Could be. We have a Renault. Uh, we don't have yellow license plates. I don't think this is going to be uh, Luxembourg. Just having a doubt if it's not Switzerland. No, we have the blue on the license on the um, license plate. It's not France, is it? No, I think this is the Flemish part of Grenzland, Roselere. Uh, yeah, this is going to be the Flemish part of Belgium. So the northern part, so if you have an imaginary line going from Brussels up, it's roughly the Flemish part. Okay, I'm a bit closer than them. They got a Belgium as well. So I'm ahead, but not by much. Everything can happen, especially with triple damage. Here we go. We have Rome, Vimiero. This sounds like Romeo. This sounds like Portuguese. Uh, we're in the Northern Hemisphere. I'm going to go for Portugal very quickly. Since they're mountainous, but I have no idea where. So I'm going to hedge my bet and go between Lisbon and Porto. Oh, they went for Sardinia. Wrong guess. Wrong guess. <gasps> Is this enough? It's enough. It's enough. Victory. Woohoo. Woohoo. I'm not raising my hands too much because I have a green screen behind me. So it's woohoo. Plus 15. Did I get it? Yes, 40 points. 16, yes, 10,000, what were 10,000? No, 1,061 points, so I'm above from where I started and losing miserably. Oh, that's, uh, that's a nice one. Um, so uh, I'm going to continue playing, but I'm not going to con continue recording everything because otherwise I'm going to bore you. So I hope you enjoyed this duel uh, with a pretty good guess in Portugal, which I don't think was too difficult uh, if you recognize the Portuguese language. And I think the way I recognize this, recognized it is the EU at the end of Romeo or Rome, Romeo, I don't know how you pronounce it. Um, so that gave me the hint that it was Portuguese. So that's it for today. Uh, ciao. Uh, it's not the way you say it, ciao from Nairobi. Um, you say jumbo for hello, and I forgot how you say goodbye. Waheri, I think. Not sure. No, kaheri. Kaheri. Now it comes back to my mind. Uh, and Asante, thank you for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye.